Hi, I'm Ty Simpson, International Sales Manager for Miniframe, and with me is Donald Rich, Soft Expand Product Manager. We're here today to talk about a newest development, Soft Expand Desktop Virtualization over Local Area Network. So, Donald, what are the main differences between this device and the traditional methods for connecting Soft Expand, such as adding video cards? VGA to USB converters or wireless USB. With USB over Ethernet, one can now configure a soft expand workstation up to 100 meters and perhaps further, depending upon your Ethernet or local area network configuration, from the host. So we've eliminated the distance factor altogether. Is this correct? Yes. Now you can have the workstation still on users' desks, but place the host into, for example, a central server room. There you can do all of your upgrade software installs in one location for simplicity of your IT. You can also move the heat, power generation, power use, and noise generation away from the users into the server room. It can also be more secure because now all of the data may be actually in the server room instead of distributed under people's desks. So what is the main difference between this device and standard thin clients? Thin Client is actually a special purpose computer that's running software which replicates the user's desktop experience, keyboard, mouse, and monitor from the server to wherever his workstation is. Um, as such, it has moving parts, it ha uses a fair amount of power, and has software that has to be maintained and upgraded. With the USB over Ethernet devices, they have no moving parts, they use much less power, and there's no maintenance involved. I see you brought one of these devices with you. Could you please show it to us? Yes, this is one of the devices we're testing with. It actually has all the same connectors as you would find on a PC for configuring your workstation. It has video output, in this case DVI, but you can convert DVI to VGA. It has audio output for speakers or headphones. On the other side, it has two USB ports for the keyboard and mouse. It also has uh, power input, and it has a standard Ethernet connection for connecting to a local area network. So what performance can this device offer in comparison to the standard methods I've mentioned before? The performance is quite high. We can actually stream full HD video to the workstation using the Ether USB over Ethernet device. You can run several workstations. We test commonly with up to five using full HD video output to each one on fast Ethernet. What if some users require high graphic performance while others I want to connect via the local area network? Do I need to compromise or install them on separate clusters? No, you can connect the high performance users directly to the PC for full graphics acceleration using the graphics cards. You can also connect the remote users using USB over Ethernet devices and for intermediate distance users you can use USB either wired or wireless. Thank you, Donald. This looks like a great solution. And if you want to know more about SoftExpand or this device, please log on to our website on www.miniframe.com.